help me. I can Hey, help. this is the way to make it go. Look, my orb will play dinner. <laughs> In my first trimester, I was in and out of the ER a couple times, around 23 weeks. They said, you'll be in the hospital until you have this baby. He will come early, we just don't know how early. All I've ever heard of babies being born early is they don't make it. It was a pretty emotional, intense moment, realizing what actually was going on. Labor and delivery was like a flash of lightning for us. A resident came in and couldn't find a heartbeat, so they decided that Jude was coming. Jude was born at 24 weeks and one day, one pound, eight ounces. He was the smallest child I've ever seen, and I hope I never have to see one that small again. Blood pressure cuffs and things all over him and tubes. You don't even think about those kinds of things until you're faced with it. Being born so early and having been vented for over a month, his immunity was really low, so they had advised us to keep him out of settings with other kids until he was at least two years old. It was hard because we would want to take him places and we really couldn't. So my brother-in-law texted me and said, hey, I saw this soccer program and they start at age two. You should call for Jude, I think he'd love it. Since he hasn't really been around other kids and groups, is he gonna kinda stick out? Is he not gonna know what to do? I was kinda worried, like, is he gonna be scared? He was crazy happy, jumping around. He just joined in as if it was something he had been waiting to do <laughs> since he was born. He's gained friendships and knowledge and mentors just from soccer shots. So it's made a lasting impact. As a result of his prematurity, he could have had cerebral palsy, asthma, learning disorders, breathing issues, feeding tubes. We weren't sure if he would walk, if he would need assistance. So to see him on a soccer field, sprinting, dribbling a ball, for us it was more than just him joining the soccer class. It was him joining his life, his next step in his journey. It's part of him defying everything that they said he may not be able to do.